Few tales are told of Hades, whose very name inspires fear and penitence. I defeated Meg in the last video on my third attempt, I think it was. Um, yeah, so we're in like a... We're sort of behind the mirror here, or whatever the phrase is. Uh, behind the curtain, sorry. Um, yeah, so we'll see. We've not had one of these sell things before. Wash away my boons. Right, so we can sell one of our abilities for gold. Hmm. I'm quite happy with them, to be honest. Restore 8% health when you enter a chamber. Uh, gain a random item offered from the Well of Karen. And 50% damage. I'm going to take Hydra Light here. Can't afford anything else, so. Unless I sell one of my abilities. That might be smart, to be fair. That's upgraded, though, so I shouldn't really sell that. I like having my dash deal damage. No, I quite like all these. Let's just be patient with it. Let's be patient. Never been this far. Look in the bag. Hmm. Now we're getting somewhere. Now we're in Aspidel. Uh, right, and I, I, I know we're at the start of the video, but because I didn't stop to read the codex in the last video. After we take down everyone in this chamber, we'll read the it. The once verdant plains of Asphodel are now engulfed in scintillating flame, having been flooded by the river Phlegathon, whose hideously superheated contents could bring death swiftly even to those resistant to most heat. I'm only flame resistant, not flame proof. Hey! What the hell? So we're, we're, we'll be embarking these various new places. Right, and we'll look down from here to see how Wasn't far we've progressed. Once lush and green. Not progressed at all. Right, so, because this isn't a combat chamber, let's read the codex. Right, so... I'm going to go sort of to the beginning here. So we read about the Chthonic gods. Uh, we've got some new Olympian gods here. So Poseidon, the master of the seas, the earth shaker, brother to Lord Hades and Lord Zeus, the Lord Poseidon. I am ever grateful that while I was living, he was merciful to me. Down here, however, I must say I rarely feel his influence. All of us, we're beneath him now. I've read about Athena, Aphrodite, right. Artemis. I'm a little confused about the red one that we got. Right, Artemis. Uh, the goddess of the hunt has always held my highest admiration. Unlike so many of her brethren on Olympus, she seems unconcerned with being praised at every turn by mortals, and instead she dutifully holds her station as a master of the natural world. Yeah, it makes sense, right? Dionysus. Perhaps I ought to feel a kinship with this easygoing son of Zeus. Ze I'm going I'm to stop saying Zeus. Zeus. Son of Zeus. For it is said that he has some mortal blood in him, not just divinity. And did I not read Sir? Oh, it's been updated. The massive beast has feasted on no short supply of interlopers to the underworld, or on those attempting to escape. However, tales of the number of his heads are often exaggerated. And in his old age, his temperament has grown much more relaxed. Indeed, he seems one of the sole sources of comfort for the house's grim master. View, sir. A splendid house, such as the master's own, requires a great deal of cleaning. 
and the little Gorgon seems forever doomed to it, to do it all herself. <laughs> Weird. Well, we read Skellies. I asked for them. Among the many reasons it is best for mortals to strive to treat each other reasonably well is that after having lived sh their short lives, they may wind up stuck with one another for eternity in the meadows of Asphodel. Right, I don't. Uh, is the bot bit in bold? The new bit? That it shall find in the hands of Lord Hades' own son, whom I taught the ways of such weapons. I have a distaste for the bow. It must be said. For it was by the bow that my own life was ended early in a manner of debatable glory. May it serve the prince better than it served me. Oh, right. So this is the bow that sh shot Achilles in the Achilles. And then he was killed by... Um, what's his name? Paris, right? One of the princes of Troy, I believe. I'm going off the film Troy here. I don't know if that's the actual. All right, uh, Brimstone. Their heated, their hatred concentrates into a ray of pain that even the chthonic gods have learned to carefully avoid when possible. Right, so that's that was updated. So is this. Having now been reduced merely to their most base of negative impulses, these damnable, damnable wretches do their part to help uphold the underworld's cruel reputation. The wretched thugs. Even now, reduced merely to shades, they are compelled by evil thoughts and take to brandishing about crude weapons washed down by the river sticks. Right, we need to read about the artifacts um, so that I don't get confused when I see them on an entrance to a chamber. The darkness. Born of chaos, the underworld is a domain of pure and utter darkness. Sometimes this dark essence becomes manifest through all the raging of the dead and all the strife that can unfold beneath the earth. Right, so that's how we level up, right? Right, bloodstones. The world itself is alive, in a way, is it not? Even the realm of the dead. All of us here, the world with it. We flow through time as blood flows through mortal veins. Look carefully and you shall find that there is power, feeling, in the earth itself. And like any power, it seeks to be claimed, to be held. With all this in mind, as well as due to appearance, to be held, sorry, with all this in mind, as well as due to appearance, I suppose, do bloodstones take their name? God, that's a confusing sentence. The master himself keeps several of them, perhaps therapeutic reasons. He has even taught the prince the way to make their crimson facets ignite in an angry glow. Right, the infernal trove. I definitely didn't read all of these, I'm just getting confused. Right. Though the Master is best known for presiding over his vast realm of death beneath the earth, he has another preoccupation. Wealth, riches and the like, perhaps for its own sake or perhaps as a measure of how effe effectively he oversees his domain. Karen's Obble. The underworld is best known as the domain of death, but also the domain of countless wealth and riches sent into the river Styx along with the deceased. The centaur hearts. The equine centaurs are well known for their unlimited endurance, and although their reign has long since passed from the mortal realm above, their resolve lies on within the underworld. Sorry, the palm of power. There is not much to eat here in the underworld, conventionally speaking. The pomegranate is a rare exception, having made its way down to the depths, to these depths, perhaps alongside Lord Hades himself when he first came to this realm aeons ago. Here, this blood-red fruit holds something of a terrifying power. Uh, the Daedalus Hammer, the master artisan called Daedalus, has never known a peer, so it is little accident. Yeah, I got confused thinking Daedalus was an, an Olympian we've spoken to, but we haven't. So it is little accident that the Lord Hades hand-selected him from all the shades residing in the underworld to do his bidding for eternity and for a hallowed place within Elysium, somewhere. Cathonic keys are certain artifacts within the realm of Hades that have been sealed under lock and key. 
to prevent tampering by those not yet prepared to harness their immeasurable might. Those keys, or so they appear, are not so easy to procure. Titan blood. Deep within the unfathomable pits of Tartarus lie the remains of the Titans, who once ruled all between heaven and earth. Few traces yet remain of them, due to the thoroughness with which they were dispatched in the war waged by their offspring. The gods who now reside upon Olympus. Yet those scarce traces do exist, and terrible power rests within. Gemstones. Mortals cherish these stones of many brilliant colours, going to lengths to excavate them from the earth, to steal them, to be blunt, from the rightful domain of Master Hades. The Master also values them, for light exists in lim limited supply down here, and light refracted through a gemstone's facets is most valuable of all. And nectar is the gifts that we give. The drink of the gods is one of the underworld's most sought after delicacies, and truly perhaps one of the only sources of genuine lightness here within this realm. I think that was everything. Yes, it was the Daedalus hammer that was confusing to me earlier. Alright, let's go. Hey up. Inferno bombers. Oh god, I can accidentally run through the lava now. Okay, these are leaving lava pools behind. Okay. Ooh. Something got updated. Yeah. As if forged in, as if forged bronze is insufficient in its keen ability to put an end to life, there have been those who studied each eldritch art of chemistry to fashion devastating fiery devices known as bombs. I had to have to be careful around this lava then. Are there going to be like hidden bits of the levels then? don't know what that is, it looks like a wing. That's a pomegranate, which is pretty valuable. This looks like... All this stuff looks like we can interact with it. Right. Do we go new stuff or pomegranate? So who has wings? Sometimes it's tough to get, you know, sometimes you're gonna, I'm gonna get mixed up between like Roman mythology and Greek mythology. Um, who is it who flew too close to the sun? I'm fairly sure that's Roman mythology though. Um, I like new stuff. Do like new stuff. <laughs> I've got to go pomegranate, man. Moving on. We should have full health. Well, as long as I don't take an absurd amount of damage. Bone rakers. Oh god. Oh! Oh! Jeez. 
Jesus, man. Oh, this is getting nails. You need to die right now, dude. What? Get away from me! Oh my god, I nearly died. <laughs> wow, that stepped up big time then. Good enough to eat. Alright, that's too much of a minimal increase. Yeah, let's take a drunken flourish. Upgrade. All right, we'll get a little bit of health, but we're in big trouble here. Not finished yet. Am I not? I, I came in this way, right? Right, Karen, I just, we just don't have enough money. Gems. Mm, not too fussed about the gems. Let's go for the key. Did I only get two health? Did my upgrade finish? Oh, I'm toast. Did, did I already use my respawn as well? Oh, God. No, no. Yeah. Wow, I felt really squishy then. I'm so home. In, where will I get to restart then? Those shades are always milling about. What have I done to deserve this? Cause of death over indulgence. I'm up, I'm up. Looks like you really took the heat from one of those bloodless burn flingers back there, didn't you? I know how tempting it can be to try and catch those fiery explosive bombs they throw, but if I might offer you a bit of personal advice, you really shouldn't do that. All right. I'm going to give you a gift in the hope that you are a little less annoying. Surprise, Hypnos. I got you this. Whoa, 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 you can't bring that in here. <laughs> Just kidding. Thanks. But wait, I'll trade you. Look. Cheers, Hypnos. Chthonic coin purse. We'll check that out. Oh, Nyx is talking to Hades. Calling the snows of him? Bestowing on him all their worthless blessings here within my realm. Our realm. Explain to me how exactly this is possible, Nix. Either your limitless power has considerably waned, or you are up to something. Do not question my power, Hades. Your son was bound to be discovered the closer he came to the surface. The Olympians are pleased to know they have a distant relative and bid him welcome to their mountain. That is all. Their influence is very limited. Hmm. Lord and darkness, do not speak to me about their influence. I've seen their influence firsthand. You've made a foolish mistake. You would speak to me of foolish mistakes. You cannot change the course that has been set. Try all you like. Nix. Ah. All right, what have we got? Switch keepsakes between underworld regions. Not bad. We've got 34 of these. 
makes the fates prophecies comes to pass. That's special, I quite like that. Now let's go for this. Yeah, this cosmetic stuff, like... I'm just going to ignore until we've got a lot of this stuff. Contractor, work approved. The fated list of minor prophecies. That sounds somewhat exciting, I suppose. Guess what, boy? Made it all the way to Asphodel last time. <laughs> I fully understand how come you never liked it there. Now to trek on back, I guess. Take care. Despite the underworld prince's optimism, his old companion Cerberus, the multi-headed hound, maintains a somewhat sulky attitude for now. Yep. Yeah. Achilles made it all the way to Asphodel. Achilles, sir. I got a relic of some sort out there. A globule of ancient blood which formed after I fought with Megara. Is this really the Titan's blood I found? As far as I know, yes, lad. That it is. Though who's exactly, I'm not so sure. You'd best hang on to it and keep it safe. Your weapons. They shall thirst for it and drink it up. Not yet, perhaps, but soon. Hmm. Well, I wasn't about to drink it. Oh man! No way. When the prodigal son returns, everyone's <laughs> saying I went easy on you, Zag. Don't worry, Meg. I eventually managed to get home the painful way after all. Look, I have a reputation to uphold. You get past me again like that, you best go all the way. Now leave me be and don't think you're gonna be so lucky next we meet out there. New. Yeah, I don't want to trade any of this. Uh, the timed one is darkness. Oh, I gave that to Hypnos. All right, let's see what this this uh, it's implying it's in our bedroom. Hey, that this. must be the fated list. Yeah, I want to go lie down. Oh, it is the dead of night or the approximation of it in the realm of Hades. Prince of the underworld, Zagreus, rises from a fitful slumber <laughs> with much mischief on his mind. Mischief? Me? I was just going to have a little look through Father's stuff. Oh, cool. All is quiet at this time. Ever dreaming Hypnos put a spell upon the house as willful Zagreus had asked of him. All are fast asleep, save for the prince. It is exactly as he planned. Lower your voice, old man. I'm trying to be sneaky here. I wasn't expecting this. He ventures toward the stately throne of his Lord Father, half expecting to be caught, uh -oh. but ill expecting what he is about to find. I said shut up, old man. He does not know exactly what he seeks. He only knows that something always has felt off to him. That he does not belong. Who is he, really? Lord Hades never would indulge such questions. So Prince Zagreus would find out for himself. I'm okay, so listening. Our identities in doubt, I guess. through his Lord Father's possessions. There is not much of any import there. Ledgers and administrative parchment work. Correspondence from Olympus which he had ignored. <laughs> no trace of any reference to his son. But then, there is the note. Written finally in a hand and voice the likes of which the prince had never seen or heard. Hades. I can no longer tolerate my life here in this place. So I'm leaving, even if it kills me. 
I won't be returning to Olympus. If there is a place where I belong in this world, it must be somewhere between heaven and hell. Perhaps it's on the coast and has a little garden. Take care of Cerberus. I shall miss him. Persephone. Hmm. Bastard prince of the underworld, Zagreus, absorb the wow. contents of this hidden letter, written in his mother's hand. Right, so Nyx isn't our mother. She's like an all mother or something like that, right? Just like a, yeah, everyone's mother kind of thing. And Persephone's our actual mother. His mother's hand. My mother's hand? Wait, what? You're saying this Persephone, that she's my mother? But, but father always said that Nyx was m that liar. Interesting. He lied to me. They both did. All my life. Uh, thus did the prince discover inadvertently the well-kept truth about his lineage entirely by chance this did occur okay kind of feels like we're being set up doesn't it persephone the one-time queen of all the underworld where had she gone and why Engulfed by newfound questions and his rage, the prince decided to confront his lord and master. <sighs> you... why? You... you're... Nix, you're not my mother. All this time, you and my father, you... you lied to me? Oh, my dear child. So now you know. So now you know. But only half the truth. I can explain the rest, so... Please. It never was my wish to hurt you. Mother, I wonder, will you even remember me? Interesting. So the bed, uh, sleep in here will progress. It's never bedtime here. M maybe after we've defeated a fury boss like, uh, Me uh, like Meg. It was only a matter of time, I suppose. The fated list, the weavings, the weavings of the three fates invariably come to pass. Oh, cool! We get little rewards for this. The son of the god of the dead shall someday meet some of the rulers of Olympus. Meet Zeus, Poseidon, Athena, Dionysus, Aphrodite, Ares, and Artemis. So we can claim our rewards. My extended family seems an interesting lot. Cool. So we. Uh, is there no escape? The son of the god of the dead shall someday break free from the realm in which he was born. Can't claim that. Sonic colleagues, the son of the god of the dead shall someday meet the rulers of the underworld. Ten keys, we've only met half here. Hades, Nyx, Karen, Hypnos, Megira. Okay. All the boons of Athena. Zeus. All the weapons. Daedalus for the various weapons lots of packs of punishments of which I've got none <laughs> uh, codex entries okay cool Got you. The fate abetting prince perhaps believes it was through his own choice that he procured the fated list of minor prophecies, but it was preordained. Oh no, not this determinism thing again. <laughs> <laughs> it's all determined. Double dash. Seems like a pretty key skill, right? Yeah, that, this just seems like such a key skill. Power. A 
I'll see if we can talk to Hades. What's the latest? Now what am I supposed to do? Just sit here, death by waterfall. Shades, we've kept you waiting long enough. Keep moving next. You've got new stuff, apparently. Drapery, laurels, tilting skulls. Seatings, sure. Right, um, we could trade in some of these gifts for more experience points, right? What's on the old exchange? Give me the current special. I'll take it. And then we'll see what happens when we move out, whether we can move straight to... Uh, the names just escaped me. Asphodel. The fated list. Right, now I've got 50 XP. Uh, 60, sorry, we can... Yeah, we can upgrade both. And we'll try and prioritise getting more keys. Hey, uh, something back there for you, pal. Oh. Hey, pal, watch where you throw those bloodstone things of yours. You drop them, you go pick them up, you understand? But if somebody gives you grief, you got my permission to chuck one right in his eye. I'll just aim generally for the midsection, since the eyes are a lot harder to hit in my experience. Cheers, Skelly. Uh, should we give Skelly a gift? Why not? For you, mate. Thought you might get a kick out of this. For me, pal? Awful nice of you. Just awful nice. But guess what? I got this for you. Tit for tat, you understand? It deals the deal. Cheers, mate. Lucky tooth. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Twenty chambers, I guess, gets you to the boss fight. What's that one there? Right, so we picked up the bone hourglass. Oh no no no! The Chthonic coin purse is what we got from Hypnos. Receive a hundred to spend as you please, once per escape attempt. So every time we start a new run, we have a hundred gold. Yeah, it's okay. I imagine that will get a lot better as we rank it up. Um, we should maybe try and max this one out. It's three stars. 37 encounters. Okay. And then automatically restore 50 when your life total is depleted. Huh. Is that like a... Yeah... Yeah, that's pretty good, man. Well, uh, we'll max out the one Another we've already weapon. got. Need a key. Right, now we can try the spear. It's time, Baratha. Let's remind ourselves. Ain't not bad. Oh, right, like uh, Kratos. Or uh, Mjolnir. That's got serious range on it, man. That's the stuff. Got to remember to hold that a lot more often. Now, do we have to do that whole run again? What? How do I go to Asphodel then? Don't stick around on my account, boy. -o. Maybe I just have to do it every time, I don't know. I need to add one of these. Won't get extra bounties this way, but why not? Family. Death is your only family. 
Death and I. Best get accustomed to the both of us. Hmm. No, not on your life. Okay, so we, we have to go through Tartarus. Unless I'm missing how to do it. This mark, almost like a bat wing. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. A bat wing? Hey boss, found you. Good. Hermes, at your service. Pleasure. You are the talk of Olympus. Normally I wouldn't get mixed up, but for you, I'll be making an exception. Now come on, we've both got places to be. Hermes. Faster special. After taking damage, quickly dash to recover some health you just lost. I don't like that. Hold uh, flurry cast. Hold cast to fire in rapid succession. That seems kind of rubbish as well. I don't like any of these. I really don't like any of these. I'm just gonna go for a faster special. Appreciate the lift, Lord Hermes, sir. Now let's go. You're dead. I already lost some health. Good job, Matt. The Eternal Spear. It must have been a sight when Lord Hades wielded Varatha, the, Etern Varatha, the Eternal Spear versus the Titans, driving back those fiends into the depths together with the help of his Olympian brothers and sisters. Uh, Hermes, one of the free spirited sons of Zeus. He is patron to travellers, traders, even tricksters. Youthful in spirit and appearance, he could be mistaken for a common lad if not for his extraordinary swiftness. Right, so how quickly are we going to be able to get through here now? Wretches. Spam. Maybe we'll be able to get through quicker now. Okay, Dionysus or maximum health. I wasn't a big fan of Di- Oh right, my- My special's quicker. Oh right, it's, t it's difficult to know where these slot in the tree, right? So we don't have a special ability on that yet. The problem with getting max health is that I don't have great health recovery. So, or any health, re real health recovery, so. Let's just go for Dionysus. Nice, let's have a drink. I have to wonder, man, what's going through your head? I mean, I know you hear me and the others, but it's so damn dark down there, I can't hear you at all. <laughs> all right. Attack inflicts hangover, drunken dash, or trippy shot. Let's go for trippy shot. Cheers to that.
Oh, the double dash. I forgot about that. Thank the gods. Yeah, we're getting through much, much quicker now. Right, gold or pomegranate? I'm going to go pomegranate. I know we've only got one ability, but... Yeah, this double dash is really crucial. God's grant me strength. That fog is awesome. The perfect gift. I really like that fog. There's no point going to see Carrie because we've got no money. Um, is that Aphrodite? I feel like it is. Yes. Here's a oh. gift for you, Aphrodite. Lady Aphrodite, I am truly blessed simply to have made your acquaintance. So <laughs> this is for you. <gasps> Lasting relationships are built on reciprocity. So if you lavish me with gifts, why, what am I to do but give you something in return? Yeah. I'm honored, Aphrodite. Eternal Rose? What have you got? I'm so fortunate to have received the boon of Dionysus prior to my own. He, the most noble and important of us all, the god of wine himself. Interesting. So I wonder if these are going to synerg there's going to be synergies, like I bet Athena and Zeus work together or something. Interesting. Attack deals more damage and inflicts weak. I like it. Dash deals damage. And I'm not in love with dying lament. When flows are, when flows when foes are slain, they damage. I, there's a sensation. I can't remember what it's called. You know, because you you read slightly ahead of what you're actually saying, and then sometimes the words like cross over in your brain and come out wrong. So I was saying I was trying to say foes, but because I was reading ahead to the word slain, it came out as flame. Right. When foes are slain, they damage nearby foes and inflict weak death blast damage as well. That is pretty good. I'm just I think I'm just gonna take Heartbreak Strike, because it's an epic as well. Maybe it synergizes with Prophecy Foretold. What the hell?
Wave makers, okay. One time scions of so many long forgotten cults, which worshipped monsters slain by heroes at some point. These remnants of the living yet possess capacity to give a certain shape to diabolic energies. Yeah, they were nails. They were really tall. Some extra health. More numbskulls. Oh, that is amazing. Come and get it. Yes. Man, that um, Dionysus thing is really slick. Yeah, I'll take a trial. I'll put it up. You dare. Oh, come on. Oh my god, I'm losing it here. Wow, I lost a lot of health then. Darkness. That really wasn't worth it. The master has since traded in that terrifying weapon for an even larger two-pronged fork he likes to brandish in threat. Noting sometimes that its superiority to the trident of Lord Poseidon, which he insists is a mere copy. Baratha, meanwhile, has seen better days, but it is a weapon. But it is a weapon built for war. I'll just help myself. Nice. Why? Oh. Ten. That really wasn't worth all the health I just lost. Especially because it's the reward for the next chamber. Must be the fountain chamber I commissioned back at home. Oh, slick. Mm -hmm. That's a relief. Oh, yes. Let me in, guys. A place of calm and respite, whilst perhaps unimaginable in the underworld, occasionally is to be found, in fact. And not a moment too soon. Anything else in here? Pomegranate or another Dionysus? Hmm. I'm going to take the pomegranate. We've not had a level 3 anything yet. Right? Oh. oh my. Oh, that is strong, isn't it? Yeah, I love this trippy shot so much. I think I'm just going to take that. Level 3 for sure. Yeah, we need keys, so... Oh god. I thought I'd find you here. Now we've got to survive. God, this is getting nutty.
better help. Two you keys, nice. Nice, that means we can get those new abilities, right? Oh! little pots ah oh. right um we need some health oh whoa whoa oh, I nearly missed that then yeah an extra cast is really good I need some health, so uh, I can, in fact, get both. Should so. be useful. So we're not going to see Karen. We're going for Daedalus. Daedalus. Right, this is before the boss room. Yeah. Right. Your attack strikes three times in a spread pattern. Triple jab. Extending jab, your attack has more range and deals 40% damage to distant foes. Your spin attack charges up and recovers much faster. <laughs> fated, fated choice. One of the prophecies on the fated list indicates you will choose this. Okay, okay, I get it. I'm not using the spin attack that much because it kind of locks us in position a bit too much. I think we take extending jab, to be honest. Because that's a spread pattern, so it can, can't really hit the same target. Should work. So do we need to fight Meg again? Oh. Even if you manage to get past me, there's no getting out of Asphodel. You saw what it was like. You really want to go back there? Yes. It's not a matter of want. The way out is there, in that direction, past the River of Flame. You're more stubborn than your father. I never thought that such a thing was possible. Oh. Get the hell out of here. Now we're doing a lot more damage though. Oh my, you're, you're blowing it here. can dodge these. Oh, here comes the AOEs. Ow. Oh, 
Damn it, Meg. I need to clear out some of these minions. We've got double dash, so... Should be a bit... Oh! Be a bit more effective at dodging those AoEs. Oh, no! No! Oh, you idiot! It's always a trap! Every time, power, but for what? Interesting. Oh, I try to do this every time. We're gonna have to get good, dude. We're gonna have to get good. We need health recovery. You're going nowhere, boy. I need the help. Should I take the trade? What will we move speed? I don't think we're going to get enough money for that anyway. Um, right, guys, uh, I'm going to leave it there. Hopefully, I can continue mid dungeon. I think I can. I'm confident that we can. Oh, hang on. Let's just read, read this. The path from Tartarus is finally laid bare. Far above, the heat from Phlegathon, the river of flame, is faintly felt already, even as its dangers lie in wait. I have, I have to say that the this Biden, the spear, whatever it is, is uh, probably my favorite because it has a mix, right? We can do ranged and we can do close and we can do AoE. Uh, it's, it's a really nice mix. Um, hopefully, we'll pick up some more abil uh, some other abilities. Uh, kind of focused on upgrading our um, our uh, cast. Sorry. Um, yeah, we're picking up quite a few upgrade materials. Yeah, uh, shame that I wasted my uh, resurrect there, but. Yeah, what are you going to do? Right. We'll pick it up from here next time. Hope you enjoyed it. Leave me a thumbs up if you did. Just remember, everyone, never trust an on-crate. I'll see you next time.